Well, I thought our guys played extremely hard. Um, I thought after the first couple of series, our defense settled in and got them stopped against a good offense. Uh, obviously, we need, needed to make more plays offensively on the last two quarters uh, to be able to keep our defense off the field and get, to put some points on the board. We didn't make enough plays, obviously, and uh, you know, we missed an early field goal. That I thought was a big momentum play right at the half, uh, but we got to make some more plays offensively and uh, you know that's the only way you're going to win football games if you got to make enough plays to hold that team that's averaging 30.2 points a game to what they did uh, I thought they did an, an unbelievable job especially in the second half and they had I'm, I'm not sure how many turnovers but they got four turnovers you didn't turn any of those into the points and when you look back just how crucial was that not getting any points off those mistakes. Very critical. Um, you know, you, all, and you, you, you play the game back in your head already, and you think about three or four plays that you like to have. You know, we, we drop one on a third down. They blitzed us. We had a guy coming open. We, we don't, we don't keep, um, hit that route. It's probably down inside the five-yard line there. Um, a couple other plays. Obviously, the punt return was a big play. And then, uh, you know, they threw a deep ball on us late in the game. Uh, they gave them three points. Uh, so those are three of the plays that stand out in my mind right now. But uh, you know, when you get four turnovers, you got to make points out of them. That's one of the things we said uh, earlier this week. No, not necessarily. Every loss is a tough loss, and I, I don't take any L's differently. And even though it's my senior day, it's my last game in Ross A, I don't take this L from any other L. And all losses are tough for me. I, I can't sleep at night. I just I take everything personally. It's, it's what I do. I play football, and I'm, I'm a football player. I don't know, it's, a, it's an amazing feeling just to be able to play in Ross A one more time. Um, like, like Drew Brees said earlier, it's a privilege to be a, a Boilermaker. And my four years here have been great. And, you know, like Will said, when, it, when it's your last time to strap up your cleats and actually go out in front of the, the stands that you really work for, the people that really love you, you're actually going to have something more to work for. It's very tough because I don't just do it for me. I don't just do it for the singers, but I do it for the redshirt freshmen. The freshmen who are redshirting now, you know, when you do it for the underclassmen, like you, like the older people who was here, the older captains was here. We we trying to set and develop the young ones, and when they see like you just going and you work and you fighting to the last second all all the time, and you you just really just trying to develop the young ones. But yeah, it's tough. You fight down to the last second. Um, we wish it would have came out differently, but I don't think I'll change anything. I don't have any regrets. Um, we just needed um, we just needed momentum and we we got momentum and we did a good job running the ball today but we just didn't make a, enough plays and I could have stayed up on some runs we could have blocked better on some runs but we just all got uh, obviously you want to have all your receivers healthy and everything but uh, I think we have a great receiving core and we're going to continue to keep growing together and uh, you miss guys when they when they get hurt and everything but I think that all those guys work really hard and they're all very talented so. Uh, you know, we just got to keep working together and keep growing together, and we're going to keep making plays. Danny, that was uh, You know, we didn't really – we were just stopping ourselves. Uh, maybe a missed progression read here, uh, just a missed block there, a missed communication, missed alignment, just things that, that we can easily fix, but we got to do it. And that's that's where we need to go from here is, is just fixing the little things and, and attention to detail because that's what's really killing us every single game, it seems like. It's just this attention to detail. And, and we just got to – we suddenly we just got to stop and change the culture and say, this isn't going to happen anymore. We're going to we're gonna know what we're supposed to be doing and, and we just got to go from there. Did you guys, you know, come out and, and as a group of veterans want to play pretty well today? Yeah, we, we always want to play well. I mean, um, emotionally, some people I might have gave more on the field. You know, um, we prepared all week, um, just like we normally prepare hard. But um, I guess having your family there, having the last time you play at um, Ross 8, might um, bring something extra out of you that you didn't know you had. 